Okay. So, if you are looking in another sense at the basic concepts, how cultural studies is uh, created, you can look at taxonomies. Maybe you know that taxonomies, I mean those clusters from the modern social sciences are usually substitutions of theories. If we don't have a good theory, we were unable to develop a good theory, then we try to have a taxonomy. Taxonomy is just, I mean, showing uh, which are the classes, so like a catalog, like a catalog. So, okay, if you look at practically what we're doing now I mean, with all sorts of <coughs> understanding of culture and these different forms of, of uh, social life, uh, then we are understanding, we are trying to understand history. History not only in the past, but history now and even in a strange way, history in the future. So history in that sense is the flow of events. And if it's the case, look at, look at the key words of those two approaches. You have, you have two types of concepts here to be developed culture and literacy. Literacy in Russia to be grammarized. And you see that uh, naturally related, I mean, this literacy related to, to the written word and to the relationships between the written words. And you see the different keywords which are in the culture, in the understanding of the culture, in the understanding of the, of the literacy. In the understanding of the culture, if you are looking at the culture in this very broad sense, look at the, the key words which are there, look at the major concepts. Tradition. It's a, a, a major concept in, in all sorts of cultural studies. You have the concept of common ground which is uniting the tradition, which is a, a basic for the understanding. And you have a a special position of a man, a woman, a family, a tribe, a, a cultural unit, etc. in that sense. So we see tradition not, an abs not as, as an abstraction, but a tradition as it's carried by people. So it's not, tradition is not living alone. Tradition is living if it belongs to somebody. I mean, if um, you know, I mean, uh, if you read, I mean, bad letters, I mean, literature, then you can find definitions which are telling to you that, yeah, for a young man or woman, for adolescents, so for kids or teenagers, love as a concept can exist on its own. And very often you are describing that, yeah, that he or she felt in love with the concept of the love, so wanted to be in this love process. And then either it's very often, I mean, target is not so important. The, the, the process to be in love is more important than to have a good target for that. Uh, and then very often you discover, I mean, that your target, a, a young man or a young woman, is not proper for your, your love process, let's call it in that way. But in, when you're becoming older and you're becoming an adult, even a young adult, the targets are becoming more important for you. Not, the, not to be in love, but to have a partner, uh, which, which is a, uh, an extension of you in a way, if you want. So here, I mean, in our understanding of the culture, we are all adults. So not the, not the concept, not the tradition is important, but the, the target, the career, the people. And you see the same, I mean, in these other parts of, of names and forms, etc., which are important for, uh, which, which are related to the culture. <coughs> Group, society, school, we are together, etc. So it comes up, that 
Culture in that sense, in, in, in my understanding, is related to people. Without a, a human career, women, even very often a collectivistic career, not only an individualistic, you don't have culture. Or it's senseless to speak about culture. But you can speak, I'm sorry, you can speak naturally about grammatnosy, about literacy. Because there you have concepts, you have a literate culture, you have a, a literate person, you have functions, factors, concepts. So it comes up that the, in the understanding of the culture, we are interested in, in those practices, in those practices of people. We are not interested in, in the text itself. I mean, you can, if you have the same tradition, we are speaking about methodology, and I was speaking about this uh, complicated Iranian hierarchy of gods important by the Antian Mansi. If you look at the cultural approach, we are interested in that, what these people are doing with that ritual. What does that ritual mean for the life? What does that ritual mean for their understanding of their personal future? What does that ritual mean for the understanding of their family history, etc.? So we are not interested in that, how that, how that methodology is looking like as a text. So we are interested in the, in the living process of that ritual to be exercised. And we are interested in the meaning of that ritual for those people. Why do they develop that? Why did he... Paranoid. Amas, kider ame mu kwa patara isa aparati. Patara fuzi basa, ikut chikwara.